Hello everyone, this is Webleo TV with a small tutorial that could be very helpful for you. As you know, we are going to, as the title of this video, I will show you how you can install the Tapo TP Link app that is on your smartphone or tablet in your Google TV device, in a bigger screen on the TV or at your living room maybe. As you can remember, Tapo TP Link uh, doesn't have uh, a native Google TV device, uh, sorry, app to install on our Google TV. So we are going to force and install it right now. I'm going to use my Nvidia Shield TV as an example. And remember that you must have, in this case, a mouse, a Bluetooth mouse or a wireless mouse and a keyboard, right? Could be wireless or Bluetooth so we can control the app when we have installed in our TV. So let's begin. So the first step is to go to our, uh, you can use your control remote too, of course. You can go to your um, Play Store, Google Play Store right here. If uh, it doesn't show you sometime we we'll show you in, in different way, but you need to enter to play Google Play Store, right? When you enter there, you must uh, find two apps. The first app is send files to TV, right? This is the first uh, app you must install. And the second one is Sideload Launcher. That is a small app that will help us to open the Tapo app when we send it to our TV. Right. OK. And the most important step is to have our NVIDIA Shield or our Google TV device with a developer option enabled. In this case, in settings here, we are going to device preference. And here in device preference, we are going to the section called about. Here in about, you will find an option called build version. Here where it said build version, you are going to press many times until it says you are now a developer. Here, now if I go back, you will see that there's a new option here called developer option that has a lot of kind of option, right? So don't touch nothing. The only one very important is the first, the first one, right? Now you are going to open the, the app send files to TV here. Uh, this, is, this is not my first time, but when you open for the first time, it will ask you for permission. So allow them all the permission it asks for you on your device. And now I will show you here on your left, uh, in the left of the screen. You are watching right now that I am on my files. And here on download, I, I leave it there. I will give you, right, uh, an APK that is the app that we have on in our cell phone. But in this case, we are going to send it to our TV. Uh, remember that the, the send files to TV app should be on your uh, Android device too, right? Here on your phone should be installed because I'm going to select the uh, Tapo 2025 APK and now I'm going to share this app with the TV. So I'm going to push here and I'm going to more options and you will find that here it says send files to TV with select and here you will see that it find the and the shield TV Remember that the Shield TV and your cell phone should be on the same network or in the same Wi-Fi because sometimes if it doesn't appear, if because it's not in the same, same Wi-Fi, right? So I'm going to select there and you will see right now on your TV that is sending the, this APK to your Google TV device. In this case, the NVIDIA Shield because it's the one I have to test, right? Now, when finished, success, I'm going to open this APK, right? I'm going to open 
I'm going to use open as I said and it will start it will take a bit so we are going to wait so you want to install we installed we wait some seconds and you will see that the app doesn't show anymore nothing happened it, it doesn't appear the open screen app but now we are going to the home screen and remember the app that we installed called a uh, site load launcher well that's app will show us apps that can be show at the beginning of the screen we, or we can add as a shortcut so you can see here is the home of tapo so i'm going to open remember to have your keyboard and mouse connected and here we are right so I'm going to choose that uh, I set the terms of use, continue. I'm going to log in with my screen. Here's maybe it's a bit complicated to log in with your account that you have on your phone because you will see that if I press login, uh, you will see that if I push here, it will show me here with a little mistake the the, the keyboard and I can bring it to me right so we are going to click here it's appear the the keyboard there and I'm going to write my email and when I write the email you only need to press ok enter on your keyboard and now you click here where it says password and write put the password of your tapo app and here we put enter to enter and now you can see that the keyboard is no longer there so we push login that's the only tricks i could find and you can see right now that would say start mode is now on well i want to put try now we wait a bit remember that the nvidia shield is a powerful device but it's a bit old right now it's reaching the the, the 10 years <laughs> So, but it's a great device, right? So here we have, I have my five cameras that I have at home. Um, what is the advance of having this? Well, you can install this app in your home and watch the camera from your local shop or maybe where you work uh, or in any place you need that is on your own, of course. And until Tapo, uh, send us or to Google TV device that is very strange that Tapo don't create an app for a TV because it's it's nice to watch bigger in in our TV right so as you can see right now if I go to the first screen on the first one uh, it will show me this la 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 and we try to take away and you can see now I am on a privacy mode right and here in privacy mode that's why you are not watching anything but here's the first camera uh, and you can add of course uh, the other cameras right i'm going to show you here we're going to back here click that we're going to put to all device first one and here the the, the good thing is that we can use these arrows to put on a big screen right in the big screen and if we need to show four cameras at the same time we can do it right and here we are not going to have the problem the small problem it's not so big uh, when I have the other apps like RTSP we don't need to change anything because here we are logging with our account so will not be any any problem right so i'm going back with the control remote here remember to use of course your control remote but i'm going to back here with the mouse so there you are my friends uh, i have the only solution it's a bit complicated uh, maybe um, will be a bit complicated to install but if you follow this step uh, you will have the tapo app on your Google TV device, in this case, the NVIDIA Shield. And that is the device I recommend. So thank you very much for watching this small video. I hope 
if you like it please subscribe or give it a like just a small video and if you need a tapo tp link camera or an nvidia shields i will give you some links affiliated down below thank you for everything i hope you have a wonderful day and i see you next time bye bye